All right, let's see how this looks out. Hey friends, this is Dave here with Creative Drones on the Dave It Yourself channel. Today I was uh, working on the uh, Sport Cub here. Uh, it had a crash where I needed to fix the actual elevator. And while I was doing that, I went ahead and made a template for it um, so that I have um, the capability of making another one here in the future. So what I thought I would do is uh, basically just show you how I made this template. It's pretty simple. Um, as you can see, it's just got a few components here, and those are just by my initial design. Uh, but what I also need to do is I need to um, go ahead and recreate uh, or create a template for the rudder. Uh, it's actually in decent shape, but I want to make it in better shape since I'm going to be making this out of newer foam. I want to make that as well. Uh, and may even do uh, the rest of the uh, elevator the stabilizer here. But uh, anyway, so stick around for that, then I'll show you how we did that. Alright, so the landing gear out here. I need to finish cleaning all that junk out of there. Um, there's that. I set that off to the side trash can. Okay, so here's the uh, rudder here. As you can see, I already have a little bit of uh, double sided or some tape just rolled over ready to go because what I'm going to do is go ahead and stick that on my uh, application, which I am using the rest of this Tupperware lid. Uh, looks like it came from St. Patty's Day many, many years ago. Uh, so anyway, so what you do is, oops, sorry, I have that double-sided tape on there, so what you do is uh, you go ahead and just find a spot that would work the best. What I like to do is, since this has curves, I want to see if I can match any of these curves. And to be honest with you, with this shamrock in there, that might be fun if I can get that out of there. Oh, uh, yeah, not, mm, yeah, maybe. Uh, uh, ooh, uh, it's a tight one right there. Uh, yeah, I think we can make that, okay. So, right there. And then go ahead and stick it down. And then from there, <clears throat> instead of just straight cutting it out. Oh, dang it. I'll go that. Okay. All right, so instead of just straight cutting it out, I like to grab a Sharpie. This one happens to be the same color as the lid. Doesn't really matter. And then just draw around it right here. Okay, and it doesn't have to be perfect because you're going to cut all this out anyway. Uh, this is the notch for the tail or a tail wheel, but since uh, you may not have it on every plane, just go ahead and wrap it around there. All right, all right, one more time around, make sure I got it on this back side here, uh, oop, and there. All right, okay. Ah, oh, dang. <laughs> well, that's why I need another one anyway. Okay. That tape held a lot more firm than I was expecting. But I'll throw that away yet. Okay. So there we go. We got basically the template there. Uh, what we got going on. Uh, oh, looks like I'm missing the... Uh-huh. Hmm. All right, so you're going to be missing that regardless, it looks like, huh? Boom, boom. Boom, boom. Oh, no, okay. No, nope. that's right. All right. All right, so there you go. You basically got the outline there. Then you want to take... 